Hello, this is Dorothy Smith, and today I'm going to do a quick video of the supplies that I'm going to bring and uh, how I'm going to pack them for our Close to My Heart convention, which starts July 11th and goes through the 13th in Provo, Utah. So I'm pretty excited about it, and um, I got my list, so I'm ready to go, which is, this is amazingly early for me. Um, so it talks about the uh, creative sessions and how to get the most out of them and to bring supplies or you can share with a friend, which means you have to coordinate and talk with that friend and see what you're going to bring and what she's going to bring. So um, I am probably not going to bring pictures. I'll save that till I get back. But what I am going to bring are all the things to make whatever layouts they have in store for us, which are always very cool. So on Thursday, we're going to use black, they say to bring the black stamp pads, the exclusive one. I guess you could bring your intense black if you wanted to. Um, and a two by three and a half acrylic block, which is actually one of my favorite blocks. Um, glue dots, foam tape, scissors, and adhesive of choice. So here's my black. And here is the two by three and a half and glue dots. I take them out of the box just so that they take up less room. Um, so that's gonna go over here and I've got my scissors. I save my, my non-stick scissors for home. So, and my adhesive of choice. Well, my adhesive of choice is a Tombow. So I have a Tombow holder and I will take the, um, I'll probably take several refills. So, but I'm going to take them out of the box uh, just to take up less, less room, which is really not that big of a deal because I have, I'm going to use one of the packing bags that were available for purchase um, from the Close to My Heart website. I don't think that they're available any longer. So this is the first group of things. And what I'm going to do, so I will put those aside so I know I've got all those things. <clears throat> Friday you need a pencil. I have a pencil. Then Saturday afternoon looks like the fun day. So um, we're gonna use watercolors, which I love my watercolors, as you can see, and a water brush. It says small round. Glue dots I've got, the foam tape. So I'm bringing both the thin and thicker foam tape and some foam dots. So that will go over here. And I've got my trimmer. And if you want to bring a Versamat, you can bring your Versamat, which here's my Versamat. And I'm also bringing this small mat, which is from a zillion years ago, just uh, to have an extra mat. A ruler, I am bringing my, um, this is a ruler for doing stitching. Anyway, it's a good ruler. It's nice and thick this way. So, and a journaling pen. Ooh, my journaling pen. Okay, here's my journaling pen. And of course the adhesive of choice. So, Saturday evening, Looks like a block party. So I have all of my blocks over here that they suggest. So a one by one, a one by three and a half. I've got my two by three and a half, a two by two, two by six and a half. This is also a very good block. And uh, the grandmother of all blocks, the five by six. 
So then they say to bring your black, which I've got, and sweet leaf, pixie, and bluebird. And then the foam tape, I've got those, the scissors, the ruler, journaling pen, and adhesive. So here is my pile of stuff. So I've all got it, got everything on the list. So this is what I'm going to use to pack. So this is the bigger of the bags. Now one thing I'm going to do, oh, which I, I'm not good at, I haven't done it uh, with a lot of stuff, but I'm gonna put my name on everything. So I'm just gonna put D. Smith in Sharpie so that everything is marked um, case, in case it gets lost. I'll put it up here. Now you could use a, um, uh, a dress labels if you wanted to. I need another journaling pen. I don't think you can have too many of those. Okay, and... You know, this is really a good idea if you go to um, retreats. I mean, it always happens that people's stuff gets mixed up. So you really should put your name on everything. I'm just not very good at doing that. I might put it on the back too. It shows up much better. It's about the only place I could put my name on that. Okay, so about that. Okay, so the one thing I've got to do here is I had to use the big one. If I was going to bring my Versa mat, I have to use the big one, uh, the big bag. Now, if you didn't want to bring your Versa mat and you just wanted to bring a smaller mat, then you could use one of the smaller packing bags. They come in three sizes. So I've got all of these things marked with my name. So I'm gonna put those in there, and as I mark them with my name, then I will put them into the bag. Now I don't really care about the um, Tombow adhesive, except for the container. And this I will put on the side. Oh, Ginger's talking to me. What's the matter, Ginger? What?
And I'm going to put DS on the inside of the tag. Probably what I'll do is a little put a little name tag on the um, zipper. And I will put my list, <clears throat> excuse me, in my package. Whoops, can't forget my black, good grief. Okay, I am set to go with all of my supplies needed for convention. So now the only thing I have to do is pack my clothes and I have to think about what to bring. So I'll do something on that uh, probably in a week or so. Thanks. Bye-bye. Okay. I'm back again. I decided to rethink it. I decided that there were too many small pieces in this. And so this is what I'm going to do. I have um, packing bags that I purchased from eBags um, and the container store. And so what I'm going to do is put some of the like items together in smaller plastic bags because really the inks, uh, this is going to go on a plane and, you know, who knows what the inks are going to do. So um, I'm going to put like items, like I said, together. So here we go. Let me see if I can figure this out. So what I was thinking of just having um, all of the inks together. Let me see. Where's my big mama? Here it is. Here's the big mama. So that's not going to fit in there. So I think this has to go in the bigger plastic bag I've got. And I'm going to put it this way. And then I'm going to stack these blocks to try to get all the blocks in together. I feel like I'm putting a puzzle together here. And then this one, which is longer, has to go this way because it's too long to go this way. So, it's a half an inch longer than the large block. So, there's that. And that ends up being kind of all packed together and not rattling all around. Okay, so this is going to be like a little pencil bag from your grade school days. So, I'm going to put the uh, pen and scissor... I'm going to put all the adhesives together. Maybe it was just the pen and scissor. I thought there was something else. Okay. So that's going to go in its own bag. <coughs> Excuse me. So I'm going to put the adhesives in here. Hopefully. My Tombos. Uh, what else is in here? I know there's, okay, I have my foam tape and then my foam dots and then the micro dots and the Tombow adhesives, adhesive. So that's all of those. Now, I didn't have a bag. So see, that's, it's not rattly. So I didn't have another bag that would fit my um, inks, my four inks. So I went and got a Ziploc bag. I think this is the quart size Ziploc bag. And look at this. snug but they fit perfectly and that way if I don't know 
pressure in the uh, packing area of the plane. If anything happens, then I've got the ink more contained. So I'm going to put, keep my uh, ruler, these long things in there. And then this is going to be just so much neater and easier to find because I'll, you know, I'll just be able to say I need my adhesives and just grab the bag of adhesives. So I like this much better. I think this works much better and it's neater and not quite so rattly. And so there, okay, so I'm packing my packing and just making it more organized. So there we go. Okay, now I'm really ready to go, I hope. <laughs> Thanks. Take care. Bye-bye. This is Dorothy Smith signing off.